five must-read Rust books that will take you from complete beginner to a competent Rust developer, starting with Rust for Rust Stations by John Jensen. Once you get the basics of Rust down by reading the official Rust book, available for free at doc.rust-lang.org book, Rust for Rust Stations is the perfect next step to really get a deep understanding of the language. John is well known for his in-depth YouTube videos where he breaks down advanced Rust concepts like lifetimes, async programming, and unsafe Rust. His book will give you a rock-solid understanding of Rust's core features, and more importantly, it will teach you to think like a Rust station. I've personally gained tremendous value from this book, and I still keep coming back to it every so often. Overall, this book is essential reading for anyone looking to really master Rust. Next, we have Rust in Action by Tim McNamara. This book is your gateway to practical, hands-on Rust programming. Tim was the head of Rust education at AWS, where he worked with multiple teams to help them adopt Rust at scale. In his book, Tim takes you on a journey of learning Rust through real-world projects. While you're going through this book, you'll build a DNS client, your own operating system kernel, and even dabble in machine learning. So if you want to understand how Rust can be applied to solve actual problems, this book is a must read. Speaking of hands-on Rust projects, the next book on the list is Zero to Production in Rust by Luca Palmieri. If you're interested in backend development with Rust, this is the perfect book for you. Luca guides you through building a production grade web application completely from scratch. You'll learn about testing, error handling, observability, deployment, and more, all in the context of Rust. This book really bridges the gap between learning Rust and actually using it in a real world scenario. It's also a personal favorite of mine, so make sure to check it out. Next up is Idiomatic Rust by Brendan Matthews. It's one thing to scrape together a function functioning Rust app. It's a whole other thing to write your application in an idiomatic way, using best practices, Rust-specific patterns, and avoiding anti-patterns. And that's exactly what this book covers. Brendan does a great job teaching you how to write clean, efficient, and idiomatic Rust code. You'll learn things like how to structure your Rust project, take advantage of Rust's unique type system, and avoid common pitfalls. This is a great resource if you're looking to write code that other Rust stations will admire. The next book on the list is Programming Rust by Jim Blandy and Jason Orendorf. This comprehensive guide to Rust is perfect for those coming from other low-level languages like C or C++. This book covers a wide range of topics from basic syntax to advanced features and compares them to features in other languages like C++, making it a really valuable reference as you progress through your Rust learning journey. Now, these are the must-read Rust books I personally recommend, but there are also a few honorable mentions that you should know. First, we have Rust Atomics and Locks by Mara Boss. For those diving into concurrent programming, this book is a goldmine. It explores low-level concurrency in Rust, which is critical for systems programming. Next is Black Hat Rust by Sylvine Kirkor. If you're interested in security or ethical hacking, this book will show you how to leverage Rust for offensive security. Next, we have Programming WebAssembly with Rust by Kevin Hoffman. This book teaches you how to use Rust to create high-performance web applications using WebAssembly, a technology that's increasingly growing in usage and popularity. If you're interested in becoming a Rust developer or are just curious about the opportunities, make sure to get your free Rust training at letsgetrusty.com bootcamp. Hope you enjoyed this video and remember to stay rusty.